Yeah, hey everybody, what's up? It's Brian with you from the Game Comment. We're playing more Gathering Storm. We are continuing with our Sweden playthrough and we ended up with an island by ourselves. So um, we'll get ironworking. I think after ironworking or bronzeworking rather, let's go for sailing. Let's get some ships up and let's do some exploration. Got Galapagos right on top of us, which is awesome. I think everything else as well. Yeah, we got plenty of city locations. About to throw down number three. Um, we really could get uh, Magnus up here pretty quickly with provision. That's probably gonna be our next goal. Uh, uh, let's bring you back and if barbarians spawn around Antioch, that's fine. Antioch will take care of them So I just kind of want to uh, have vision on all my stuff. So we were gonna settle on the desert tile, correct? We got plains and grassland. I Think we'll settle on the desert tile kind of negates the city up there But once again, we could just go somewhere else. I mean it doesn't matter like you can settle multiple plains city It's not the end of the world we have two grassland cities right now, and the thing is, we're still quite a ways away from open air districts anyways, so it's not that big of a deal. Where, where was it at? We saw it before. There it is. Yeah, it's not till nationalism, so we got a long time before we have to worry about that. So let's just get cities down. So 17 to 24, nice, nice, nice. Uh, I'm going to work on a builder, actually, first, I think, because there's a lot of good things there. We got irrigation. No, we don't. So we'll want irrigation before too long as well. Probably we'll do sailing and then um, bronze working or irrigation. So let's bring you over here then. Maybe? Maybe? Trying to figure out where I want the barbarians to spawn. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure where I want the barbarians to spawn. I don't necessarily think I want them to spawn over there. Because it's going to be a little hard to get to. So I think I'd rather bring you right there. The uh, early Empire is it's done. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, let's keep it like that. So the early Empire, now we can get a boost towards settlers. Sweet. Let's go ahead and go for state workforce. We already improved and we already built a special district. Both of those are nice. Normal age, we're gonna go for, man, I think uh, inquiries is just better. I think it's so much easier to get Eureka's versus um, the civic boosts. Let's see, clear barbarian outposts. We've yet to see them. Research construction technology, maybe. Build a wonder, probably not. Declaration of war, probably not. Build an encampment, eh, probably not. Build two campuses, found a religion. Uh, well, we will find the religion. Let's see over here though Meet another civilization. I would hope's gonna happen build an iron mind. Maybe We already kind of boosted all the easy ones over here You know what? You know what? Next we actually get a religion this turn. I think let's go with the civic one. I think this might be easier. Usually don't think it is, but there's only one here, man. That's the only one we're gonna be able to get. Two campuses? Probably not. Quadrine? No. Grow population to 10? No. Own two galleys? I think is possible. Meet another civilization is possible. So right there's two points. Um, build an iron mine probably will happen. Build a pasture should happen. Do we have horses? Yeah, there's two cattle. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do inquiry. Okay, keep going. This is also going to give us vision through this array anyways, um, every once in a while. So you're coming back, and I think everyone else just fortify where we're at. What about this? Is that a hill? That is a hill. Yeah, let's put you on the hill. And you can just fortify there, that's fine. Okay, I think I'm going to put my warrior all the way back here, just so it's a little closer. Uh, where is the iron? Are you freaking kidding? We got one freaking iron again. Are you kidding me? Oh, our Ottoman game, we got one iron as well. Oh, like, off our city. Like, what the heck, man? <laughs> what the heck? I was hoping Gathering Storm was going to fix some of the spawns where you just don't get any resources. Apparently not. Apparently not. So, what do we want to do now? Do we want to build a wonder? Temple Artemis? Nah, probably not. Probably Builder. Keep fleshing out our cities. We can shop, get our population a little bit higher. We have irrigation incoming. We could build some units just so we have a little bit of protection. Um, sailing's coming in a couple turns. Let's get a builder and we'll go to sailing. How about that? All right, so let's go ahead and do... Oh, there it is. They changed the color. It's more of a blue now. Nice. And we're going to do commonism. 
So this is not communism, this is communism, like the Game Channel. <laughs> what do we believe as <coughs> the Game Channel? At, like the Game Common. <laughs> there. What do we believe in? Well, we believe in reliquaries because we want triple uh, tourism. Right! Is there anything that's going to give us diplomacy? It's actually a good point here. It also gives you more faith, which is really nice. Shrines give culture equal to their faith. I actually, because here's my only concern. Reliquaries is great when you're going for a culture victory. I don't necessarily want to win culturally. And there's a chance we might accidentally win with culture. Where is something that's going to give us diplomacy? Anything gives us diplomacy? Missionaries are cheaper to purchase. Religion spreads. Now, the isolation is what you do. So you go reliquaries and then you do isolationism, or isolation, monistic isolation, so you don't lose any population when, and you basically just go ahead and suicide some of your uh, great prophets, or your uh, apostles. I don't know about this, guys. I suppose we're just gonna go that way cultural. I think we're just gonna go for a culture victory and we're gonna try pivoting to a diplomacy victory, diplomacy, and we'll just see what happens. So. There you go. There you go. Congrats. Uh, you're staying there, and I think we're good to go next turn. We actually got a religion. Pretty big. Pretty big. Doesn't usually happen. Like, you can see... There's what? I think only one more religion left? I hate that you have to go here. Uh, three of five, so there's two more religions. Were we likely to miss out? <laughs> yeah, actually. There's three other people going for it, so if we wouldn't have bum-rushed it, we would have missed out. All right, we got full vision with that guy. I like it. Another city state died? No. Yes, unmet city state has been defeated. Uh Oh, we met Lisbon. Gotcha. More money. What do you do? Trader units are immune to being plundered, so you're still the exact same as well. Where is Lisbon? How the heck did we meet you? Must have had a galley coming my way. And we're the first one to meet him, so there's no one down south. All right. Good to note. Let's get galleys and let's get some freaking. Honestly, it might be worth it for us to go straight shipbuilding, so we can get um. So we can go ahead and, and get maybe some extra cities on a different island. That's gonna be the thought, or that's my thought process at least. We can't afford galleys. We need a lot of extra gold before that will happen. I like the fact that we're making plus four gold in our capital though. That is nice. And like I said before, you're just gonna come all the way over here. And protect me. Craftsmanship is complete. We can go grab you. And I might as well keep this. It doesn't really matter. Oh, no. Production towards naval units. Good job. Production all cities. We are producing a builder. But I would rather just have production. We're producing a couple builders. Actually, three builders. I'd still rather have plus one production. Because here's the thing. Like, what is your production? Plus three. Or it, it's two something. So getting an extra 30% of two is only going to be uh, 2.6. Where getting plus one, so it's an extra plus six. Getting the base plus one is just strictly better. That might not be the case with our capital. Yeah, that's not the case with our capital. It's also not the case here. But that's still fine. Because they're still getting production, and then when we finish the builders, we'll be able to build something else, and we don't have to worry about switching it off. It's great. It's great. It's good. It's good. It's good. So, that was actually our governor title as well? No, that was craftsmanship. Did we get a governor? We have a governor. We don't need him yet. Put him in Stockholm, because remember, we're going to go for um, uh, provision. We didn't really look at any of the difference, like, all the differences with the governors, but that's okay. We're going to do that in our live stream. Which is yesterday now at this point. I'm recording two episodes. Pretty much back to back. Uh, I am tempted to chop and build a mine. We were going for the green route, weren't we? But rainforests are just terrible. They're just terrible. And mines don't produce CO2 base. It only allow me to get like fishing boats. What current tiles are you working? That would become a 2-3, I think. Actually, maybe it's a 1-3. It's a Plains Hill, so it would be a 1-2. So the Rainforest is giving it an extra food, so it would be a 1-4. Or no, a 1-3, because the mine's just going to be plus 1. 
So maybe it's not worth chopping out yet then. And we'll replant forest, don't worry. Don't worry, we're gonna do that. Let's worry about the fishing boats first though. And then you're gonna pop out a galley. Three turns. Might actually buy the second one, honestly, at this point. You are gonna go get me diamonds. And then we'll go get the mines. And then I might take you over here and get the horsies. Ah. Uh, we never grabbed irrigation. I want shipbuilding, but I need irrigation. Um, Seven turns, not really worth it. I don't really necessarily care about a holy site. Let's just grab the monument. Extra holy site is extra relic. At some point, yes. I just don't know I want to use it right away. We could also do rice here, too. It's going to be a plus four or five. Also, it gives us more farms, which is one of our boosts. A strong so, sure. And there's our extra governor title. So, we're going to promote you and provision, please. Thank you. So, um, I think let's go settler as soon as you're done. And we're going to be able to afford the ship next turn anyways. So, we're good there. Okay, okay. We good. We're off into a really a uh, great start. We really are. I should grab military tradition for the flanking, but we're not at war, so let's just knock out political philosophy. Um, we might want to switch off of it, though. We'll see. We'll keep an eye on it. The galleys should help us meet another city state. All right, I want to take you down this way because we knew that there was no one down there. We also knew that we uh, Lisbon was able to get to us, so we should be able to get to you. So I think we want to get a settler, maybe on that island first. We'll see. So pop on another uh, units. Pop on another settler, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're gonna get me a farm, and... <sighs> I think I am gonna chop it out. It's also gonna give us more food. So our city's gonna grow a little bit, and that's gonna help pop off the settler quicker. Quicker settler means quicker cities. It's all good, right? Uh, and let's go ahead and buy our second ship. We'll buy it over here. And that gave us some era score as well, and you can go south. Cool. I'm not too worried about necessarily coming and someone coming and settling over there, but there's a little concern. All right, I'm going to take you this way. Yeah, because we want to go see what's over there. Sixty-five gold. Why are you growing there? Why are you growing there, man? Either way, we got irrigation incoming, so let's go get the wine and let's go get the oranges. Our people are going to be very happy. Yeah, we're going to have very happy people, which is awesome. No There's Lisbon the again. Today. Hello, Lisbon. Okay. Not really what I'm looking for. Giant desert tile right now, but, you know. Sure. Sure. Let's keep advancing. Mm, not really the island I was looking for. Let's just be honest here. Ooh, hello. Hello, someone else as well. Who is this? What colors? So they completely screwed up the colors. It actually looks like the Ottomans. Um, but they did change because everyone has multiple banners now. Didn't they say you could select it at the home menu? You know, I think they said you could select it, and then I think they took it back and said you couldn't anymore. Or they misspoke on that. Because you're originally supposed to be able to choose different, uh, like, team colors, basically. Yeah, Ottomans. Nice. Kaiser. I like that. So, this is interesting because we just did random. I wonder if there's a preference to getting Rise and Fall sieves. I don't know. Either way, we should have a lot of crap to make you happy with us. What is your agenda? Lawgiver. Keeps assistants happy and loyal, impressed by those with similar priorities, especially if their cities were founded by many players. Dislike those with happy, loyal issues. Well, we... He should love us. He also has two other people near him. Now, if we trade away all of our amenities, we will no longer be happy. <laughs> uh, let's wait a little bit. So, I'm okay waiting just a bit. Because we're about to get a uh, double wine and we can then send him wine. We don't really need money right now anyways Don't really need it. I Might just want to put a city over here just to lock in our continent now Uh-huh, and we can get another one over there sooner rather than later Because here's the thing we're ugh, I was hoping for more vision. 
It looks like this is part of his island. If we get a city here, well, number one, that's gonna allow us to get the iron. What about settling on the iron? We could. It's a nice Petra city, man. If we can make it work. One, two, three. Like, we could go right here on the Plains Hill. This would be a 2-2. We could actually go for the Petra. This would be a ridiculously good Petra city. Downside to Antioch's probably going to steal most of these tiles. Even if we built the city here, this would be a 2-3-1, which is a ridiculously good city. Uh, we can build a couple mines. I think we might actually go for the Petra. After shipbuilding, we might have to go mathematics, go for an early Petra. Maybe? He wants open borders, open borders. He wants to give me dies. He wants some diplomatic favor. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to say no on that, sir. Because I don't really know what that is good for yet. Give me at least a little gold. Come on. Give me a little gold. Yeah. I don't know if 50 is a lot or not. <laughs> So we got the 50 because we got the great profit, correct? Sweden. Plus 50 when earning a great person. So that's why we got 50. How does he have great people, uh, favor? Now having alliances gives you favor as well. So we're gonna want to make him happy. So we're gonna want to keep that agenda going. Cause we'll want to ally with him. Uh, where's my actual city stuff? There it is. And let's see, we should be happy. Ecstatic, happy, happy. Okay, that's what I was hoping for. So he should be liking us because of that. Apadana got finished. That's an early Apadana, man. Uh, I want to actually look here and see what the... Are we... No. So we're not... Um, We've not triggered him yet. Valetta. Nice. I like that color. Plus two production when producing units. Now, oh, I'm trying to remember. I think... This does count for settlers. I think that does, because technically they count as units because they're under the unit tab. If I remember correctly, and I'm pretty sure I do, those do count. So, yeah, we do want to grab Vleta then. You might not exist long, and it doesn't look like you will, unless you're fighting barbarians. It looks like Ottomans are actually warring on you. Are you at war with them? No. No, you're pieced. Unless it's someone we hadn't met yet. Is that one wine or two wines? That is one wine. We could sell it off right now, though. There's no reason. Because we're going to get another one next turn. So, hi. Do you want the wine? 180. He's got four horses, man. And two iron. What the heck, man? What the heck? And we don't got any freaking iron. I'm a little mad about that. Also, he has freaking six cities already. What? Did he conquer someone? I don't know. I don't know these city names well enough to know whether or not he conquered someone. How the hell do you have six freaking cities? It's turn 63. Oh my lord, deity. Oh, freaking heck, dude. There's no way he built settlers that quickly. So I don't know if we're going to have a pathway through here. As these guys melt, we might end up with a pathway through there. But got some time. You're going to get me wine next, next turn. Um, government Plaza is really good. I think we're going to worry about putting that in our capital for now. Just go knock out a granary. Let's keep growing. You're going to need the housing. Okay, so this is a one tile. We could actually just settle here, too. We might be able to settle here with the city. Well, with the city there, we can definitely settle there. Nah, no pathway. Dang. Waste. Freaking waste. Are we going to buy another galley? We could buy another builder. What, um... I usually don't end up buying settlers because they're so freaking expensive. Yeah. And you just keep popping out these settlers. What about buying a granary here? That actually is probably our best bet. 260. I bet you're having housing issues. Yeah. Okay, I think that's what we'll do. Keep popping out settlers, and we'll go from there. You're going to come over here. It's going to give us another elephant, which we could uh, make our people happy with. You're going to give me the wine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And get a granary here as well. Although, you're not going to have housing issues. 
Well, you will in a little bit. You will in a little bit. Extra oranges. Ah, Poundmaker. What's up, Kree? Is Kree different at all? Good question. Number one, send a delegation. Number two, view grievance log. Nice. Kree. New trade route. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alliances. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This all looks normal. Replaces the scout. It's a little better now that the scout upgrades to a skirmisher. And then this all looks the same. So I think Kree is the exact same. Okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. You can start going over here. Just to make sure no barbarians spawn. Balls. <laughs> well, he's going to hate us. Politics is the art of the post. Sweet. So let's declare. Uh, da, 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 send delegation. Number one. Number two. Your oligarchy. Your oligarchy. Your oligarchy. Well, we're gonna go and become oligarchy then, for sure. Let's go ahead and go for Theater Square right away, and we're gonna become oligarchy. I'd rather be classical republic, but I just want to make everyone happy with us. So I don't know if that's necessary. Let's take. The maintenance for our galleys for now. Give me production towards builders. Give us the plus two because we got envoys everywhere. We only have one trader out. We're not producing wonders. Give me the settlers because we're yeah that's what we're doing. We're popping out a bunch of settlers right now. All right, I like that. Shipbuilding uh, was already boosted, so we're good there. You got the oranges. Now the problem is he's gonna hate us because we have a lot of crap he doesn't. Literally everything. So he wants us to trade everything. And the problem is, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not trading him everything. So he's going to hate us because we don't trade him everything. Unless, of course, they toned that down a little bit. Like civilizations who have the same luxuries as he does. And will try to collect everyone. Dislikes to have a new one he does not collected. Yeah, so it's the exact same. And you are iron. Yeah, you like alliances. So we should be friends with Kree and Ottoman. I'm surprised you don't like me yet. Our cities are all ecstatic, man. You should love us. Keeps the citizens happy and loyal. Especially if their cities were founded by many players. So maybe... Maybe he wants us to actually capture cities. Is that what's happening here? He desires for us to capture cities? Then he's never going to like us. Also, we need to get this up as quick as possible, too. You know, we could just put the government plaza here. That's a nice campus. Theater square here. Yeah, let's do that. So let's put a campus here. Let's put, let's go shop this out and we'll put the theater square there and we'll put a government plaza here. I like that. Yeah. And then that's going to get boost to both of those guys. Okay. I like. Uh, you just wake up. Or just go on auto explore at this point. I don't really care so much. That's why you never hit auto explore. <laughs> Uh, Ottomans denounce America. Ooh, Teddy's in the game. Uh, okay. Another wonder done. You get your butt over here, please. And I think we're just gonna keep advancing. We're at 23 minutes. Okay, you want my diplomatic favor. I'm sorry. I am definitely not gonna trade it, although that's a lot of crap. Can't do it. Can't do it. Can't do it. non modal that is housing, right? No, your districts on coast give... Ah, dang it. Dang it. I'm thinking of uh, the other one. We have in our Ottoman game. Not Mo non modal. Man, I'm trying to think. Which one is it? Ooh, another little island up here. Okay. 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 These look interesting, those stones. Yeah, they look a little different, the stone tiles. And then you're here to chop. Put that down to three turns. Cool. You're going to do Q, and you're going to do the government plaza there. Thank you. And then we'll worry about Theater Square after that. With your extra charge, I think what we want to do... Let's go ahead and buy this. Is nine turns remaining. Screw it. 
We're gonna go work that. It'll grow somewhere else. So we want this theater square done. Um, we might... Ah, man, it's weird. We almost kind of want to chop it out, to be honest with you. Yeah, I think we might try chopping out the government plaza. Because what we want is we want the free builders. So we don't want to throw our cities down until we get the free builders. So the best way for that to happen is for us to chop it out, I think. And you're still going around here. Yeah. We will probably put a city over here at some point. And we'll send most likely you over here to go get this in one turn. Cool. Okay, so you go grab this. Build that. You go there and you're going to get ready to shop. Uh, let's production focus you as well. And we'll probably go chop out the other one as well. So much reinforce, which sucks because it kills our appeal. So we kind of need to chop them up anyways. Because we want the appeal. You're going to get me a campuses, which is fine. You're going to chop out. That took off only a little bit. We could take Magnus and apply him over there, but get the extra production. I just don't think that's worth it from the chops. Uh, you need basically five turns and you can build something cool. So build a builder for now. Yo, get off my tile, man. <laughs> get off my freaking tile. Ugh. So pretty sure there's not going to be anything over here, but we're just exploring anyways. You're all the way back over here. Okay, then. Okay, then. Not ideal. You want one of my horsies. You have 20... Oh! Durr! <laughs> uh, yeah, you gain them per turn. Okay. So, I actually thought he had 24 horses. What do I want with one iron, man? Wow. Okay, like, give me a little more iron than that. This is going to completely screw with our deals. Like, how can we do this? That's really expensive. Can we do two for two? I'm assuming we're gaining one per turn. I just don't know what one iron does. What about one gold per turn? Like, I understand that two is like next to nothing. So, I'm just going to say no. You can wait another turn, man. I just don't think that's worth it. So, yeah, we're at four horses. We're getting two per turn. Eh. So then what about sending you four? Okay, will you pay me a little bit more for that? We'll actually get 10 gold now. He'll give me one gold. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think that's a smart idea. So you're getting over here. I'm going to put the scout right there just so he can uh, hold on the tile so that he doesn't box us out accidentally. And you're coming over here. Like I said, I don't think there's anything going on over there. Uh, 28 turns. Cool. Uh, I think just keep popping out the settlers at this point. We have so many cities that we want to take. I'm tempted to actually maybe even put a city over there, but probably not. Probably not. Hmm. Let's go get this city over here. We got the desert. We don't have a plane, so that's going to be good for us. Allow me to put the warrior elsewhere as well. I think I'm going to move the warrior like that direction. And we might want to just get a city down here pretty quick, too. Because we could go grab, like, tobacco and marble. And what are these? These are plains, grasslands, grasslands. So we've pretty much settled. We might want to go settle eventually down here on the tundra. Just for the hell of it? I mean, maybe. Maybe. Yo, get out of my way, please. Three turns. You're going to shop again. Uh, and the thing is, without the theater square, there's like nothing else for us to build right now. So, do we get air score for settling on different locations? Somehow, I don't think so. Great library got finished. We could do the Temple Artemis still. Probably. And you're here to shop. Finish the government plaza. Then what we need is we need the uh, Ancestral Hall. It's going to be a little slow, guys. 
Would we rather chop it out? How much production is it? It is 150 production. We're only making like 19 per chop. I think it's probably just better to buy. And then work that tile. I think that's just going to be strictly better for us. We might ne uh, not want to wait. Okay, who's next then? So we got Magnus taken care of. Let's see what they did. You're a librarian science still. Now, Reyna is more... Money, 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 money. Okay, so then who has the... You have Grants. You have Curator. Okay, so we definitely want Ping then. Okay. I don't think it particularly matters because we don't have really any culture, but we'll just grab Ping. Uh, we could have actually looked at the rest of Magnus, see if there was anything. Extra food is fine. Industrialist increases the power of each resource. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I think I'm still fine with that. We're gonna wrap this episode up pretty quickly. I know I say that like every time and then we play for like another hour. Cause it's Civ and I'm addicted. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be a dead end down here. Yeah, 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 calm down. Surprise, he still doesn't like me. Why does the Kree not like us? Is it still just the negative five? Yeah. Do you have something you want? No. Give me a little bit of gold for this. Yeah. So that should improve our relations just a little bit. Okay, and I don't think we had open boards. Yeah, we did have open boards with you. And we had open boards with Ottomans. Okay, 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 okay. Ottomans are actually pretty friendly with some people near them. It doesn't look like we can go that way. Okay, so guess what? You're now in charge of doing stuff yourself. Sounds good. Do we want to wait? 14 turns. I mean, these are free builders. I think we should. I think we should. It's not going to be a full 14 turns. Because we need another 130 production. We are about to get another two or maybe only one. We're making 10 per turn. Oh, we also skipped this one here. How many builds do you have left? Just one? What's our gold at? Can we buy another builder? 280. I think we wait. I think we wait. I think we wait. Because it's probably going to be closer to like 10 turns, in all honesty. And it's not that big of a deal. All the world's a stage. It's not that big of a deal. Theater square is necessary. We do want that as quick as possible, though. Now, the only reason to settle it's because we want to get to the iron before someone settles over here and put loyalty pressure. But I don't think we're going to have to worry about that. Uh, you go get the envoy, please. And we do have an extra settler as well. I think I'm just going to take you over here. You go explore over there. Yeah, I think that's fine. And you come around here. Go over there. There's nothing over here. Cool. Uh, theater squares are done. We could go grab our oracle and probably should go for a temple so we can get extra apostles. Probably actually want to spread our religion a little bit too. Uh, Missionary is 150. Cool. Build the mine. We don't have enough for the other build. This is down to 12 turns. I could have harvested the stone. That was our other option. But production's kind of crap, so that's where I think maybe we stayed where we are. Um. Okay, here's the other question. Can we get enough air score? Build an iron mine. Minor resource. Prove two sea tiles. Build three mines. No, because this is going to give us what? I think plus four air score. So I don't think it's going to be enough. So I think maybe it's even worth it just waiting till next turn. Just to get the extra air score next turn. Because if we're going to have a normal age, we might as well have a normal age. Hey, he likes us. Uh, yeah, I'll take your favor, dude. Um, we're going for a diplomatic victory, so we want all the favor in the world. And give me a little more gold. How about that? How about 100? How about 50? How about 30? Really? 20? 25. And then your favor. Mr. So that allows us to get this guy. And then we can go grab that. Cool. 
And then with the warrior, or the extra builder that's popping out, we might want to just improve the sea resources. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I don't really. Uh, we do want the culture. Yeah, give me the culture. Plus two culture in the capital. That's fine. And let's see, unit maintenance, production, all saves, production towards settlers. I think that's still the route we want to go. Also, this trade route's got to be done here pretty quick. I think it's done next turn. Okay, well, let's just wrap this episode up here. We're at 35 minutes. Uh, for now, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, and let me know what you think, as always. Hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, show your support. Are we making diplomatic because of that? I don't think so. We're getting plus one from government. I think it has to be alliances to get more diplomatic favor. All right, I'll see you guys next episode. Bye, everyone.